So I friends, this is Amit and you are watching my channel information and educational videos. So here I will provide you the complete analysis of Bitset examination of session 2. As you all know, the examination has been started from 3rd of August. So here I am with a complete analysis of both the SIP as they have provided the similar question in both the SIP. You may think that there was different type of question but overall difficulty of both SIP was same. That's what I got from the first feedback of the student. So here I will try to do the complete analysis. So if you are first to my channel, please try to subscribe to the channel and also if you want to check the marks versus branch what you can get in bits at uh, this year that is bits uh, bits college all three campus all branches i have discussed you can check that video in the i button as well as the discipline box so the first reaction of the strength was that this time they have asked the more tough question as compared to session one obviously it will be not as tough as j means or advanced but it was tougher than the typical bit set examination paper so if, no need to worry if you are getting a little bit less mark then also possibility will be there after doing the analysis of all the day, if I will, I will think that there should be a change in marks versus rank data. I will try to provide you the updated. But as of now, you can refer that video. So now I will discuss the discuss the subject wise difficulty level and important chapter that you should look for upcoming SIP of the examination if you will appear next. So first of all, let's talk about mathematics. But before that, I would like to inform you. I will be, I will be providing you the complete in, complete counseling guidance up to your admission is done for all the counseling whatever you will do this year that is bit set counseling as well as josa counseling jack daily c seb comet k k set a triple e every type of counseling whatever you will do if you want you can contact me through instagram or whatsapp number there is a nominal charge for that so let's continue this video first of all let's start with mathematics as it was the toughest and it, it was expected that mathematics is used to be the toughest in every entrance exam so same is here but the problem is that the time is less and a student have find it very difficult difficult to, to solve the question because it was tough as well as the time constraint was there that's why the student have faced the problem in particularly mathematics so now if you will ask about the uh, difficulty level i will consider it as a toughest paper if you compare it with typical typical bit set examination not moderate this moderate to tough and most of the student have find it tough so it will be it will be considered as tough for both the shift i am telling you and now if you talk about the important chapter from where they have asked the question so the important chapter was again calculus part was more that is derivative limit and application of derivative integration as well as coning section was also there so it makes the paper a little bit difficult or you can say more difficult and also there was question from matrices determinant vector 3d those were those question were a little bit easy as compared to other question there was question from prob probability distribution as well as sequence and series and complex number linear inequality so these are the chapter that you can look for but only if you have covered the chapter if you haven't covered no need to do that because you have to consider your strength whatever you have done in last two years that that will give you the marks in the examination no need to do the uncompleted chapter in a hurry because that will not help you in the examination so i will suggest you focus on your strength so now if you talk about the physics so physics was moderate type neither so much hard nor so much easy but it was moderate type but there was some question that was tricky particularly from mechanics as well as the optics chapter but there was easy question from modern physics as well as semiconductor also there was question and from the uh, so a newton's law of cooling that is that is thermodynamics uh, as well as there was question from newton's law of motion and kinematics as well so these are the chapter that you should look for in the upcoming attempt now if you will talk about the difficulty so difficulty was moderate as i already suggest about the physics earlier so now if you talk about the now if you talk about the chemistry that was that was easiest among all but there was typical question and more weightage was from organic part so it makes the paper a little bit difficult for the student but it can be considered as easy to moderate because most of the question were from ncrt particularly from inorganic chemistry and physical chemistry that is solid state solution chem chemical kinetics and also the question were from uh, spdf block of element as well as the coordination and compound and also there was question from uh, chemical bonding so these are the chapter that you should look for and no, not to forget the periodic table as well because that will help you to solve the other chapters question so this was the complete analysis of of day one of examination that is session two day one august three complete analysis of bitset examination 2022 so hope you get this information very useful for you so again i'm informing you i've already provided the marks versus branch data for this year that is all the three campus all branches i have discussed so please try to check that video you will get the complete information thanks 
So now I would like to introduce the Philo app where you can get the solution of all your question, doubt or you have problem with any type of concept related to J or NEET or boards examination. Then you can get the solution 24 by 7 with these three easy steps. That is first you have to download the Philo app in the play store and then you have to do the sign up process using your mobile number and after that take the photo of your question and upload that in the app and after that within 60 seconds you will be connected to the India's best educator. Okay, question mein aap kehna hai ki bulb ki power kitni hai agar bulb jo hai. वो 220 वोल्टेज पर ऑपरेट हो रहा है राइट इस बैटरी का जो वोल्टेज है वो आपको गिवन है 220। तो ये आपको सिंपल रिलेशन हो गया यहाँ पर अब अगर कोई आपको और डाउट है तो बताइए सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग योर टाइम डाउनलोड द फिलो एप लिंक इज अवेलेबल इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स एंड यूज द कोड आई ई बी डबल जीरो वन यू विल गेट द टेन परसेंट इंस्टेंट डिस्काउंट